Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy for the After Years. So, in total of hours, I left the game for about how much? Seven thousand hours, of course. It was like a week or so, like seven hundred hours. Mm, my math sucks, but. It was around 700 hours times 10. Let's see on the saves. Wait a second. From how long did I left it? 22... 0 to 27? Wait, what? For some reason the date is 27 now and last time I played it it was 16. So it was around 11 days times 10 of non-stop auto grind. Non-stop 24 by 7. <coughs> I just changed spots once and then to just get different items like silver apples, soma drops, golden apples and mega elixirs. Of course mega elixirs, golden apples, soma drops and silver apples are really rare, so I had not much time to grind the remaining mega elixirs to 99 too. <coughs> Besides that, I upgraded my bot so that the common drop will no longer uh, uh, freeze my grind and it will be automatically skipped if uh, my inventory is full because I would have uh, like 700 remedies um, few thousand potions, few thousand high potions few thousand rioters, X potions and so on and so on that would be a lot, and about a million of maiden keys. For some reason, there was a lot of maiden keys and uh, heavenly wrath in the spots I hunted. So let's get some matters <coughs> and proceed forward. I will be go <laughs> googling, looking into bestiary later on to see. What else can I hunt? Auto hunt? Oh boy, not not yet. Return to be one. Go to Lunar Whale. <coughs> oh boy, I became ill again. We go to triple question mark because, except what I grinded here. My main objective of, gr of grind were tails, which I gotten quite a high amount to, which I'm proud of the grinding. <coughs> a few thousand hours, seven thousand hours, man. Pink tail ten, red tail two, green tail two, blue tail eleven. Black tail to purple elevens, uh, gray one, white seven, and those small bronze and silver are not important. So time to do the grand exchange, and speed and speed the exchange all the time. <coughs> Blue tail gives us blue armor. Mm. 
it will be around 30 or 40 tail exchangers in total. <coughs> Man, that's a lot. <laughs> Once we exchange everything, we will just go and do our best to um, to proceed further after equipping those new items. What I will use... Oh, I uh, did already blue tails, okay. <coughs> Green tails give us rare band V2 that I already got earlier. And use because rare band V2 gave me a higher chance of getting more tails. And rare band V2 is green dragon. Where you hunt it in the Barbaricia zone. In the secret area. Okay, all greens have been used. Let's do reds. Level band V2. This will still be useful for a seed. That isn't level 99 yet. Okay. <coughs> Mm, let's go next. Blacktail. Twin stars? What are those? I remember I got twin stars somewhere, but I maybe sold it? I don't even know. Hmm. Did I sold twin stars? Reduce MP use by half during battle. Oh boy. So twin stars from original and twin stars from the after years are different. Twin stars from original give you twin meteor. Twin stars from the after year have your MPUs during battle, which is great for auto grind. Man, Rydia would never lose her MP. <coughs> Alongside gold bears, and they could spam flares. <laughs> Next black tail twin stars. Burple. A burple tail treasure band V2 for that. <coughs> Let's go another. Like seven purple tails. <sighs> treasure band V2. And what treasure band V2 does is increase your chance for a drop. For all sorts of drops, that is. While a rare band V2 only increases. The rare item drop chance of uh, already... Mm, how do you call it? If you have 100% chance on drop some item, then there is no 100% chance that this will be a rare item, you know? And rare band V2 helps with this, so there is a 100% chance. Or around 80% at least. Since there wasn't 100 all the time. Burple tail. <coughs> so if you combine uh, treasure band V2 200% and uh, rare band V2 200%, you could theoretically get all of the drops every battle <coughs> I believe that's the math behind the 
Purple Tails. Oh, I finished trading Purple Tails. White Tails. Rapid Ring V2. Those will be precious. Rapid Ring V2. Those will be precious against Omega. Against super bosses that we will challenge. <coughs> Okay, all white tails have been traded, so let's go gold? No, to gold we have uh, guild panda already. Grey tail was it? Rich ring. That's interesting, rich ring. Okay, we'll uh, exploit? No. We'll read what Rich Ring does later on. A bonnet tail already traded. And now, Pink Tails. Oh, I'll trade you a suit of pink armor for that. Let's go. <coughs> I will uh, all I will trade all of the pink tails to pink tails well were especially hard to fucking get because of that single oh, annoying flance that break your auto battle and you cannot auto battle those so naturally my bot broke too, which was annoying and I ho had to grind manually for the pink armors and oh boy, oh boy, believe me it was painful pink armors were the most painful to grind I wonder if uh, this pain was worth it <coughs> Pink armor, and let's go. What type of armors do I still get from those tails? Hope uh, the armors will be the best ones. Since I don't remember what kind of armors those were. Okay, we traded everything. So it's time to re-equip everything blue armor defense 45 magi def 25 strong against, against dragon machine and giant attacks that's a good armor actually Cecil that's really a good armor it even improves attack for Kain what about pink armor 25 death, 10 magi death, pink armor, plus 7 death for Rosa. Let's go, anyways. <coughs> what? 25, 25. Wait, what? If I get pink armor on Redia, then Minerva Bastier that we currently were is 20 defense to 5 magic defense and pink armor is plus 5 plus 5 more and protects against status effects what? so why only my magic defense raise when 5 of my defense should raise 2 and why do I lose 2 on attack? 
Lydia. I believe this isn't work for you. Nor it is for Porum. <coughs> Oh well, we won't have pink armors. The pain wasn't worth it. <laughs> because Minerva Buster that I got 99 of was better. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. <coughs> Let's read uh, the ring descriptions now. A rapid ring V2 greatly reduces standby time. Oh, less waiting, nice. Provoke ring we know, rare band we know, guild band we know, twin stars we know. Treasure hunter V2 increases normal item drop rate. Economical ring is extremely rare cause it is the only ring in the game. And we can only get it from the from the Edwards uh, secretary. The rich ring allows higher damage from back row. That would be good. <coughs> so let's equip everyone with. Um, rare band pro, a rapid ring V2. A rapid rings will help a lot in the ne upcoming bosses, so let's wear them instantly. <coughs> a rapid ring V2, let's go. Porum Rediarosa got it, Cain got it, Cecil got it. Let's proceed onwards to our next adventure. As we completed this area here fully. Only trading way remains. And that trading way will become a challenging way, I believe. Or new challenging way will sprout out in this area once we finish the game. The interdimensional elevator is online to Lunar Whale. Descend into Lunar Subterrane. Deep parts. And now, after getting all of those <coughs> items, it's time that we will max our party HP up. What does it mean is I will use all of those golden apples and silver apples to get our party to 9999 9 HP and this will be extremely satisfying to just click through. Ding ding! Cecil is full HP. Full max. Kain is full max HP. Rosa is full max HP. <coughs> and Porom is full max HP. We've made our party extraordinarily powerful, so no one ever can win. No one ever can win against us. Go to next B15.
Let's do the same dive. Sky grinder, let's go. Blessing. <coughs> Stop, miss. Kyuraga. And now flare. Oh, I can use the flare on Redia. She will be slower, however. We have 99 white fangs too. White fangs, blue fangs and the red fangs I would have hunted for over few thousand amount, if not for what I already got. So let's equip Redia with the Twin Stars. <coughs> she will need this for her mana amount. <coughs> and now let's grab some chests. Monster in a box. Malboro Menace. <coughs> Doom and Gloom, Flare, Kao, Elixir and Remedy. I can't even pick up Elixirs anymore. Wait, what? Ah, that's how you go here. <coughs> Crystal ring. <laughs> oh no no no, I don't want to fight Proto Death Mask. <coughs> Let's run. Monster in a box. I can easily kill Mal. <coughs> <coughs> oh boy, Malboro Menaces. <coughs> However, I can't get those elixirs and remedies from them. Expulsion. Incoming new boss. Let's use elixirs on ourselves. Since we... Or, or never mind, let's use setters. To get ourselves to full. And save. And... Incoming boss. Crystal Shatter boss. There you stand in my way. Start. Ghost train. Incoming. <coughs> Sky Grinder. Blessing. Kyuraga. Meteor 50, Flare 25. Let's go! <coughs> <coughs> the mana costs are so good. <coughs> Diamond dust. Uriah. I don't even need to cheese the game anymore. <coughs> That's how easy it is now. <coughs> I'm curious if Hall will heal him or damage him. It damages me for sure. <coughs> Arm.
10,000. So I don't need to load, okay. Another 10,000. Another sky grinders. <coughs> That's why I like white mages too. Alongside summoners. I wonder if I can tank through this. Or if I will need to use at least one mega leaks here. <coughs> Hold. Countered with hold. <laughs> oh boy, I feel like a tank after this. <laughs> it was so worth it. I love it. <coughs> oh, let's shoot out. <coughs> I will use Kyuraya now. 10,000 and... Ghost Train goes in the bank. In and lightnings too. 36,000 EXP. Final Fantasy VI boss has been defeated. The ghost of a train. Is there anything we have yet to face here, really? Where was that train going, I wonder? It seemed so sad somehow. I felt as if I could hear the voices of the dead. Thank you, Mutsunokami. <coughs> and another satisfying part will come soon. First I need to do something before that, like uh, close Steam, close Epic Games, close Utorrent. And now let's turn our macro. And this is the satisfying part. Now, let's go further. Since we healed up our HP to full. Wait, there is secret there. Sky Grinder Blessing. Kyuraga. Flare and Auto Battle. Soma Drop. Ah, I have 99 of those. How to get there? Fin Dragon. Protect Ring, huh? What's with the loot rarity? How do you even get here, huh? To this chest. No, 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 no. Okay. Ooh, that's how you do it. Lunar gloves. Oh, this time this is a blue crystal. Earlier it was a dark crystal, so let's use our dry ethers and heal everyone up. Of mana to full. <coughs> Boss incoming. Crystal Shatter. Ultros. I remember this Ultros. Ho ho ho. You aren't getting past me, no sir. No picking on me now. Orthros. In original Final Fantasy VI. He was Ultros. Rosa, Redia, Porum. All very cute girls, my favorite candy. <coughs> Sky Grinder. 
float. Curaya. <coughs> Flare. Ugh, I hate Muslim men. All Muslim things. Constrict. <coughs> Earthquake Miss Penta. Sky Grinder <coughs> Let's see if Holy damages him or heals him. <coughs> damages him good. So I can hold this spam now. Holland Flare Ultros Start taking it seriously <coughs> Miss all status effects <laughs> GG Seven thousand constantly <laughs> Ultras has suddenly changed Incoming serious fight Finally, time to haste Redia. <coughs> haste Redia, Cecil Kain, Rosa. A rapid drink, it will be really quick. I mean, my turns, and I can tank through the enemy's attacks. Quick, quick! Ah, Ultras was easy. He didn't took it seriously enough. Free kill obtained. <laughs> One year experience. <laughs> kitchen knife. Oh, that's where we get the kitchen knife. Uh, instead of the young swipe, we get it from Ultros. <laughs> uh, <coughs> what? What just happened? I don't quite understand what happened, but I think we defe defeated him. I I really don't like octopuses. He wasn't such a bad guy. A little strange, but yeah, Redia. No chest from him, huh? Sky Grinder Blessing <coughs> Auto Curaga and Flare Auto Fight. And let's go. Wait, what? Why do I get so much drop steel? I wonder. Eggy shield, what? Do I need to equip or do I not need to equip? 
The treasure hunter items. What the heck? There will be a drop. Dragon shield. <laughs> what the heck? Rerepan. Treasure hunter V2. I just need to have it in inventory and it already works. What the heck? It may be a bug though. Like many others within this game, like impossibility for Golbez to wear all sorts of armors. <coughs> and another drop. 100% drop chance, let's go! <coughs> though I'm sure I will need to fix it now. Because it is a bug though, and I want to play it legitimately. So, I will see you everyone in the next episode, after which I will fix this bug, just uh, because this bug is already too much, I mean, we've got uh, infinitesimal advantage over the in-game bosses, so why even prod further with item advantage? I will try to fix this bug. Maybe re equip the treasure hunters and this should fix it. Hmm. Anyways, thank you for watching and see you all in the next episode. Hope you upvote, comment and subscribe. Bye bye!